this is surface seven with another uh, box opening. All right, let's get to it. Careful here, don't cut myself. All right, let's see what we have here. We got a box within a box. All right, let's put that one down for now. Let's see what else we have. Oh, we got this. Oh, okay. Oh, we got this one. There we go. Oh, there it is. Better. Put that one down. All right, let's put this down and open these other ones up. Let's start with this box that was in the box. All right, now, all right, guys, look what we have here. I got a 750 hard drive. 750 gigabyte hard drive by Western Digital, Western Digital Black Edition. Nice and anti static bag. Let's cut this open here. This is a regular traditional hard drive, <coughs> storage drive, that's what I'm going to use it for. Let's be careful here. Look at that. Nice label there. Serial ATA interface 2. For three point uh, three gigabytes per second transfer speed, so that's gonna be my storage drive right there. Uh, this is uh, it's got thirty two megabytes of cache, and uh, like I said, it's Western Digital Cavalier Black Edition. Read uh, a lot of reviews about it. It's a decent hard drive for what I'm gonna use it. Okay, let's put that one aside there. Let me open this one up here. And what do we have here? Alright guys, this is uh, from OCZ. It's a uh, agility series, 60 gigabyte, serial in phase 2, 2.5 solid state drive. Uh, it's the new technology what they're using as solid state drives. And let me open this up right here. Wow, it's a little tough here. Uh, oh, it comes in a little black envelope kind of folder. <coughs> what we got here first? We got some uh, some info on the drive. Congratulations for choosing OCC 2.5 serial solid state drive. Got the drive itself. A little small guy there. I guess you can use it on laptops or desktops if you have the the kit for your computer. <clears throat> like I said, it's only a little sixty gigabyte. One, it's a small one. I didn't know this opened up this way, but it's okay. And here we go, guys. It's just a matte black finish with their little stick on there. And on the back, it's just a little more information there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Both of these together here. I guess you guys can't see that that great. Well, we got our traditional drive right here, which is 750 gigabytes, and we got our solid state drive here, which is only 60 gigabytes, good enough for. OS drive and the difference between these two the solid, the solid state 
runs off a, a memory and it's uh kind of has like a controller on it and it's uh it also I think it also has some uh onboard memory <coughs> this one has big platters on there it's like a disc with a little needle going back and forth reading the information writing the information on there and uh that's why it's 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 cheaper and it's bigger because it's old it's uh it's not new technology but uh, they they're catching up. Solid state drives are catching up, and they also have a hybrid drives that have both of them combined. They kind of have like a 40 gig solid state drive inside uh, the traditional hard drives, which helps it speed up a little bit, but not that much. But you know, and it's also that's like 125. The the Momentum XT thing I was looking at, and uh, it's good for you know if you it's a 500 gigabyte, so it's pretty decent with a solid state drive on there. Well, anyway, guys, uh, that's it for now. I'm gonna uh, play with these a little more and see see what, uh, how good they run. Surface Seven out.